Welcome to Zero Page Homebrew, your best source for the newest Atari games. And tonight we're going to be playing some 7800 games. Yep. Three of them. Um, and they are Rip Off by Bob De Crescenzo. Nice. Frogus by SIO2. And Super Circus Atari Age by Bob De Crescenzo. Nice. Uh, or De Crescenzo. Oh, Maybe he can uh, phonetically spell out his name. I, I'm you sure I get Bob Decrescenzo. Do Bob Decrescenzo. I think you're right. Yeah. Okay. Who is in the chat tonight? Yes. Yeah. So he can help us out with <laughs> any questions that we have or nice. questions for the chat. I'm so glad he could join us mm -hmm, tonight. Mm -hmm. uh, I want to thank all the Twitch subscribers who help support the show that are scrolling beside Tanya, like a a game show uh, co-host. Yeah. Where you're like. Do, 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 do. Showing off the prize. Uh, 8 bit Swami Al Nefer, Arms Guard Coder, Atari, HBR, Pocot, Buck Owens, Cafe Man 2D, Chance, Chals, 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 Charles and Shaq, Charles Wheel and Chai Vibe, Dan, ABC, Char Dr. Moo Cows, Emmy Dan, Fox Mulder, Glenn, Maine, Gray Defender, uh, Ground Trip, Orger, Rapper, Johnny WC, Carl G, Kev Kelly, Croco, Lauren TDZ, Marco Yan, is Mark's Mace, Inc., Mick Muse, Mike Soul, Mike Littell, Miss Command, MK Smith, Mr. Zarnu, Mr. Fix, Nathan Strum, Neo Media, Op Vocal, R and Deco, Pack Ravi, G Quahog, R and Schwitz, RC70, Rendered Ghost, Prentless VG, Ricardo Pim, Rod Castler, Six Sweet, Smitty B, Spartan 581, Spicer S, Ramirez, The D Train, The Welshman, Tiki Dan K, Team Events, Trek MD, Victor M and X, Ken X, and Atari, if he could, he would support it. But he's yes. here in support. Yeah. Um, you can uh, support the show too if you have Amazon Prime. Just link it to your Twitch and it's free for you, yeah. D, D Crescenzo. Not D. Not D. Not, not, not okay, D thank you. D Crescenzo. D Crescenzo. Not so too very far close. off. Yeah. D Crescenzo. I'll try to remember that. D Crescenzo. I can't promise anything. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, yeah, there's no really any mail or news or anything. I've been very busy, so I might have missed some. Mm. But uh, today I placed the order for Zero Page Homebrew the Game. The cartridges for that, because uh, I finally got around to making the label for it. Nice. So I sent that to the Atari Age store because nice. you can uh, you can order your own carts oh, if you make your own game. Awesome. Without doing anything special or having like, listed make there. Make it up for you, kind yeah, of thing. Yeah, and and they'll send Hello. send you the carts. Um, it's a service they provide. I think it's twenty five dollars a cart. Um, yeah. Um, so uh, we will schedule the show for that big reveal and giveaway of carts mm -hmm. uh when i know when they're going to come back so i'll i'll schedule you that you have yet to put in your order for for uh, coasters oh that i'd like to place my order right now okay okay i need four i think okay yeah um that's a good mononym mononic 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 Pack D Man Plus. <laughs> um, and my Atari Jaguar is still in the mail. It is making its way here slowly. You, you keep surely. getting like false. Um, well, it said delivered. Falsely excited because it said deliver, but it actually was just delivered to a facility. And to he the was main like, Where facility. is it? And he <laughs> ran outside. He was looking in front. He was running up this, you know, like yeah, running around. Place. Where did it go? And then he came back and realized, oh no, it just got delivered to a, to a main central depot. depot. Mm. <laughs> So the ETA is says sometime this excited. week. So we'll do, oh, we good. don't know. We'll see if it actually oh, arrives this week. I'm very excited. Yeah, yeah and hopefully all in one fun. piece as well. Well, that would be good too. Not drop kicked. But <laughs> yeah. You have yeah. to expect your mail to be drop kicked, so you have to package it <laughs> accordingly. Like drop kick towards the front door. <laughs> Because if you've ever seen any video of people pack catching it, well, the oh, delivery at people, the facilities like even. throwing it onto the truck, oh and, yeah, and it's yeah. tumbling off of conveyor belts, yeah, and then yeah, at the at the very end, yeah. Just if you if you hear throw it, the person coming up to your door, just yeah. look through the people, and they're like toss, yeah, it's terrible. So yeah. Make sure you uh, pack things well. And I did remind this guy to pack things well. He didn't respond, but you this guy sells a lot of stuff all oh, the time. Oh, he probably knows. And is 100% uh, positive then on that's eBay. A, that's a good sign. That's a good sign. It is a very good sign. Yeah. Um, Al made me a nice space game 2K cart a while back, as Ramirez says. Yeah, so it, you can either even make uh, cartridges from other people's games as long as you get their permission. 
Oh, okay, so uh, for yourself, yeah. for personal use. Right? And even reproductions of super rare cards, oh. as long as you put reproduction on the label. On the label. Yeah. So it's a nice, oh, a really nice... nice if you have uh, a gift to give someone, and you're never going to get the original. That's yeah, kind of a nice idea. It is very yeah, nice. I like that. Yeah. Um, okay, so let's take a look at the games. That, that's it. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> no real news. I've been mm -hmm. super busy. Uh, the first game is Ripoff by Bob D. Crescenzo. Nice. Uh, as known as Pac-Man Plus in the chat <laughs> and on the forums as well. I have to mm -hmm. watch that cat. I made him mad today, but I'll tell you about that oh, later. Poor kid. So this was first three posted times. March. Three three times. Oh, now this. Oh, now he's happy. This will make him happier. Yeah. There we go. All right. Look Who at that tail. That? That's Carl, a happy. Carl G. Thank you, Carl G. Oh, oh. kitten uh, says thank you as well. That was a very quick, quick right there. Um. So this was first posted in the forums March 23rd, 2012. This build is from May 2nd, 2012, so it's very short. Well, that was a very light bell. Yeah. Uh, it's a 16K game. Um, should I read off all the games that Pac-Man Plus has ever made? <laughs> that would take a It's a, a huge list. Our schnauzer's <laughs> ears just perked up. You can follow along the game at home. Yeah. Every time the, big, the, 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 the bell rings, you can... Feed your, your, feed your dog every time Atari rings or, the bell. Yeah, dog or cat. <laughs> Um, you can buy this game in the Atari Age store. It is available on cartridge. Um, probably in, with a box as well, I believe. How many do you have? Oh, we're going to have to I've search away. That's okay. That's okay. Um, okay, so let's take a look at... Well, this is an was an arcade game. It's a port of an arcade game called Ripoff, which yeah. is a strange name. Um, and especially since it was released on Vectrex, too. Like, would you name your game Ripoff? And uh, expect people to be like, oh, is, is it a ripoff? <laughs> so it, it did come out in the, um, the Vectrax here um, because it is a vector game. Yeah. Like in the arcade, it was a vector game. There. Yes. Um, so let's take a look at the arcade version of it mm -hmm. and see what that looks like. So we get an idea of where the game uh, came from. So here we go. And I actually added audio ducking to, let's see, it should work, I don't know, it may not be enough, oh it's a bit loud, it's a bit loud here too, um, added audio ducking so it should, yeah it works, reduce the volume mm -hmm. when we talk, and then bring it back up when we don't. Um, so it says, Ripoff is a multi-directional shooter with black and white vector graphics written by Tim Skelly and mm -hmm. released in arcades by Cinematronics in 1980. It was the first shooter with cooperative gameplay. Mm -hmm. Shooter, okay. And the first game to exhibit flocking behavior. Interesting. So I'm guessing the enemies have flocking behavior where they follow each other and, and they, react they to each together. other. Oh, I see. Yeah. That. Okay. Uh, Ripoff was ported to the Vectrex home system in 1982. Tearoff could have been an alternate name, yep. Audio what? Audio what? Uh, the objective of Ripoff is to prevent computer-controlled enemies from stealing eight canisters set in the center of the screen. You can see them there. Oh, ah, oh, ah. What is happening? I'm trying to... There's very full shelf up here. Yeah, so don't... I don't know where are going to go. No. No. Nope. They're going to fall. They're going to fall. Uh, so there's, oh, he's lost a couple canisters there. Uh, um, one or two players control tank light vehicles while game controlled pirate tanks rush off onto the field and attempt to drag the canisters off the edge of the screen. Enemies can be defeated by shooting or colliding with them. Mm. The game speed and difficulty increase with each successive wave until all these canisters have been taken, ripped off. Mm. Um, so you can actually run into them without yeah, and losing, explode them. there is no men it's mm. all about the canisters yeah um so you getting shot or dying it doesn't matter but you do have to come in obviously yeah. after you die after you die you you get start but you it looks like you don't die if you run into them no um but if you get shot it's trouble mm. and you can't yes. it doesn't look like you can drag them back to the center either yeah you don't die if you run into them no you don't die if you run into them you don't die if you get shot you just yeah, you just reset, which 
gives you uh, a, is a oh, problem. You don't die if you were oh, okay, okay. But they're shooting all the time, so yeah, it's, you, it's you, dangerous. You're, it's very dangerous, yeah. yeah. So uh, super cool. So we got a good idea of what the very cool. what the arcade version looks like. So let's take a look at. I think Carl G's question was audio docking, ducking. Oh, ducking, said. ducking. Um, it's like you know when you you're coming to a very low beam in a house mm -hmm. and you duck underneath it. Mm. It's kind of like that. The audio level. Mm when something else is playing goes down a bit mm -hmm. and then when like when we're talking and then when we're not talking it goes back up it goes back up yeah that's i guess what it means Audio by ducking ducking okay um it's you hear it a lot on like radio stations uh when mm. they talk um and of course youtube channels you hear it all the time mm. when people are playing games so i last time i added it to the video game and mm. now i've added it to sound when we're playing stuff that's not a video game, like just web pages and stuff. Gotcha. So, so I don't have to keep adjusting up and down things. Yeah, that makes sense. It makes it so much easier. Mm. Okay, so this is a one or two player game. Mm. So we're going to start with a one player game. So is the two player cooperative then? Like you're yeah, both preventing so. preventing the bad guys from stealing your... Uh, we'll do you find out. Carts? Cartridges? What do they call them? Uh, canisters. Canisters. So we have easy. easy, normal, hard, easy. and one or two players. Yeah. Uh, very nice title screen. I like that. 1980 Cinematronics, 2012, Bob DiCrescenzo. I have to say it a bunch so I can memorize it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, it's got a little, don't press anything. I'm not pressing anything. It's got a little demo mode. Very nice. So in the Atari Age store, it says Ripoff is a ta top down vector shoot 'em up arcade game released by Cinematronics in 1980 and brought. To the Atari 7800 by Robert DiCrescenzo. It is the first shoot 'em up arcade game to feature cooperative gameplay and exhibit flocking behavior. Taken mm -hmm. straight from Wikipedia, <laughs> apparently. Okay, so let's start it up. Uh, yeah, easy probably. So I believe button two is accelerate and button one is fire. So shoot that dude before he gets to your canisters and rips them off. So there's a bit of color to this. Um, your canisters are yellow, you're pink. And the enemies are white? Yeah. Because in the... Uh, in the overlay for ripoff for, ve uh, for the Vectrex, it's kind of got an... Uh, not an octagon? No, it's got a six-sided... Um, oh, no! Do you take one? Yeah! Oh, you, no. You got me. Oh, God, this acceleration thing is... It's hard. Oh my god, this is so bad! Oh my god! Shoot him! Shoot him! There you go. Yeah. Oh my gosh, it's the acceleration. The, t the two button is, is Color from artifacting or color color? It, it looks like color color. I'm not sure that my system does... I don't think it does artifacting. So, um... I would have to fiddle with things to make artifacting work if I could. I'm not sure if the retro tank would support artifacting. So I oh, oh he my stole god, it. he oh, he still so, got it. He's so fast. I, like I can't even accelerate. Oh my goodness! Look at these guys. It is better that it's not pure white. <laughs> the cat's helping. Hi, he's not helping. He's like, I, I beg to differ. He's like, you need some help. I will perch on your joystick. <laughs> Look at this cat. <laughs> You are not helping things, Atari. <laughs> I would just set up a wall of bullets that they have to pass through. Yeah. Um, when you start a new game, your pirate destroying yes. ship is will appear on the right side of the screen. Oh, there is no sound to the art, uh, video game. Somebody should have told, told me that. Sorry. <sighs> there you go. Now you can hear it too. And not just it in the <sighs> distance. Oh god, this is terrible. Kittens! Look, this cat is <laughs> sitting on my hand. It's warming your arms. <laughs> uh, in a two-player game, the second pirate destroying ship will appear on the left side of the screen. Your canisters will be in the center. You must guard your canisters from the pirates who will try to steal them. The pirates can appear from anywhere in the screen. Steer your ship with the joystick left and right <sighs> rotation. Move your ship forward by pressing the left button or up. Oh, you can push up. Can you? Oh, can you? Oh, God! <laughs> Or yes. Oh, well, it doesn't. I don't know. Does up work? 
Oh, it does. Yeah. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> oh, oh, they last got them all Shoot it, shoot it. Oh, one left. Go guard it. Get over there. Oh, it's so slow to accelerate. Ah! Oh, ah, no, you went ah. past it. Well, they all missed it. You still have a chance. Oh, it's going for it. Oh, just get over there. Get over there. Protect the last canister. Oh, God. What could be in these canisters? Oh, the games are, uh, uh, thinks there's Doritos in them. Or they are Doritos. Yeah, protect the Doritos. They are very uh, important. They are triangles. I like how they're, they're pulsing. Oh. Were they always pulsing? Or is it because. No! Oh, oh my gosh, they're, it's hard. The what did you get? Is quite, quite oh, sad. there's no score. They are Doritos. You need to protect your Dorito Doritos. What's the score? Oh, they're, that was your score 2850. 20, okay. Oh. Um, yep. so press the, <laughs> wait, wait, there, press the right button. Okay. Uh, shall I try an easy first as well? Yeah. Yeah, it's, 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 it starts nice and slow, which is nice. So you can kind of get used to it. It's the acceleration I need to get used to. Press the right button to fire lasers at the pirates. The, the pirates can be destroyed by colliding with them, but you will then have to wait for your new pirate destroying ship to appear before you can fire more lasers. It's not automatic. It's manual firing. The game is over when all the fuel oh, canisters are stolen. The Doritos. The Doritos. Protect the Doritos. Protect the Doritos. <laughs> As you pass each six waves of pirates, you start with the first pirate wave again, and the pirates start at a faster speed until all six pirate waves are at the maximum speed. Uh, easy. You start out with one pirate per round and one round per wave. This applies for both one and two player games. You have to defend eight canisters. Normal. For one player games, you start out with two pirates per round and one one round per wave. For two player games, you start out with all three pirates per round and two rounds per wave. You have to defend eight canisters. Always eight. Hard. You start out with all three pirates per round and two rounds per wave. This applies for both one and two player games. You have only four canisters to defend. Oh, geez. And the pirates have an increased speed, so they start off fast. Fast. Okay. Oh, my God. Interesting. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, he stole one. <laughs> the D train. Any good news or mail? We didn't do mail today. Because there is no mail. There is no mail. Well, I didn't check the mail, but. You didn't, didn't check? Well, that, that I didn't was expect not. any mail either. But. There you go. Uh, no news. Just Nothing big. No. Personal news. <laughs> very, very simple. My video froze, Pac-Man Plus. Oh, no. Restart. Reload. It's all good here. Yeah, all good here. All green. Green across the board. See? I just sit in the center and become a turret. Ah! Oh, the fast. They're fast. Yeah, the turrets are good, but the ones that move fast... And also, if you can't hit them at the angle they're coming at, it's really annoying. And they can run into you, too. That's which is fine. Annoying. It's annoying, but it's yeah. fine. See? Hey, hey, See? hey, hey, get back you here. You can get them at the angle. You have to move a little bit. I think they... that's, that's key to the game. <sighs> yeah, I don't want to move. Uh, they, uh, they know your angles. They, they move according to... Look at those. <laughs> See, they're dodging the angles. Thanks, the, the D train, for checking in. He's got just, reading to do, so he's just logged in for again. a second. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, bye. Hi, bye. Well, it's nice to. Oh, oh no! <laughs> Carl G. News. I hear that someone slapped someone else at the Oscars. <laughs> oh, I've heard that too. I've heard that as well. Don't know who it was. But... No. Clearly, Celebrity there's not been news. enough coverage of that because I don't know. We stole it while it was not. I wasn't oh. even on the screen. Oh yeah, no, they can do that. They're mean. Oh no, Me. stop stealing it! No! <laughs> Ooh, if I sit just above it, mm. they have to pass through. MK Smith says some news on Petski. Got the first round of music back. Wow. Oh, nice. excellent. All's fair in love and Doritos, yeah. <laughs> now I, I want Doritos. I really want Doritos. Oh, Doritos. What kind of Doritos? We, do, we have a bunch of chips upstairs. We do have chips. None of them are Doritos. They're not but... Doritos, but they're sort of Dorito-esque Dorito chips. Dorito -esque. Um, are they? No, they're not. Yeah, yeah, they've got flavors on them. Well, There's a Cool Ranch and respect, a Nacho one. I'm thinking about the, the, but they're more like... the shape of them. Oh, no! No, 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 no! Oh... <sighs> 
Yes, looking forward to more Petski, Attack of the Petski Robots. So mm -hmm. I got, is that my score? Mm -hmm. What did you get? 2850, something oh, wow. like that. Yeah, you beat Okay, so we're going to increase the difficulty mm. and go for two players. Yay, two players. Normal? Normal. Normal and two. All right. There we go. Ooh, everyone's excited. <laughs> oh, I bet it will sound good Kay. on the Firefly. Okay, let's do it. Oh, I am greenish. Is there friendly fire? Oh, I hope not. No. no. Thank you. Oh, thanks. I'll protect the bottom. You protect the top. See, they don't know where to go now. Because they can't use their angles anymore. Because we're at different... Uh, as long as we're at different horizontal and vertical spaces. So don't, they're often um... from the bottom for some reason. Yeah, they are. Oh, now there's some there. Oh, oh God. no, Shoot no! Em. Sorry, right. Sorry. I, I was like, shot. oh, that's you. No, that's not you. <laughs> I'm like, that's a bad guy. No, that's that's my friend. <laughs> Definitely easier with two people, I think. Because they can't be just off your bullets. It's not as easy, it's not as easy for sure. Oh my god. Keep shooting me. What a fun two player game. It's good. Yeah, I like it. You can kind of turret. Which yep. is good. Let's just spin, spin and shoot, spin and shoot. No, it doesn't work. Ah! <laughs> ah! No, 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 no! No, oh, he how, how? Stole one. Oh, they're running into you now. No, 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 no. Good job. They're dive bombing now. Very tricky. No, 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 don't be on the same vertical or horizontal plane. Or, uh, yeah. Because then they can't use their angles. Yeah, you can't pick up the Doritos and put them back in the center. No, they're stuck. What's the other game that's like that, too? Where they steal things uh, that we've played. It's not this game, is it? We have never played this game. Not this game, but something very similar, for sure. Well, we might have... You might have played this in the spotlight, very briefly. Oh, no, it wasn't this Because we played, you played every game I swear, Pops. maybe I just played the Vectrix version of it. Uh, possibly? Because I've definitely played this a similar game to this before. And it might have... Uh, ah, no! No, we're both dead! Shoot, 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 shoot! Oh, great. Got your video back. Yay, Bob's back. No! Oh, it's funny that he doesn't just go straight off the screen. Yeah, you would think they would... Oh! oh. I got him. I got him. Get my ass back there. It's very interesting there's no lives. It's, oh. it's thrown me for a loop a little bit. It's like, oh, I died. Oh, it's okay. It's okay he died. Oh, you what? hit me! Does friendly How fire did you come do in? That? No, I think you can't hit each other, though. Oh, okay. Yeah. You I, can shoot, but you can't it, hit it, each other. It appeared that you hit me. Yeah, I definitely did. The graphics in this are so nice. I love the vector-looking uh, the vector -looking graphics. I should say you ran into me, not you hit me. Yeah. Well, yeah. How many... Looks like it has one, two, three, four... There's a lot of... Oh, my God. Shoot him. Oh, that was... Uh... You're a bad guy there. A lot of... Like, how many are there? How many? One, two, three, four... I can't count! Oh! Oh, those no! Guys. Shoot him! No! He's stealing! Oh, gosh. They're all no, over they're the place all now. they're all over the place. Oh, they're fast. Oh. Get him! Get him! Get oh, him! Oh, I couldn't. No. He's too dodgy. And he's trying to evade me because you weren't on the screen. So that uh, he... Could use his angles. He knows exactly where to go. Pac-Man Red did the graphics. Ah, he is so good at pixel art. Oh my god! You do have to move. Like, you can't get them at every angle. Oh. There's like a mega thread on the Atari Age forum of Pac-Man Red's graphics. 
unbelievable. If you ever get a chance to just um, go through that thread for like an hour or so, there's so many graphics for so many games. Um, so if you're ever at a loss for what game to make, um, there's pretty much graphics that Pac-Man Red has made. Better with a spinner. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It would be. That would be very difficult without a... Oh, right into me. Did I crash? I didn't crash. Yeah, you died. You died. No, no, but you I didn't. didn't. No, no, no. The guy ran into oh, me. Oh, we're in trouble now. They're all over the place. Get him, oh, get him, oh, get him, get him. Oh, you oh, the... oh. So many bullets and he evaded, oh. evaded all of them. Oh, we've only got two left. This is... What are you doing? Don't crash into me! Ugh. Enough trouble with these dudes. Oh boy, they're all on this side. Oh my god. No! It's gonna be game over! No! There's one left! Protect the last Dorito. Oh, the last Dorito, no! guys are brutal. No, 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 no. Shoot, shoot, shoot him. Oh. oh, no. <sighs> That's fun. Yeah, how would you do this That's with funny. a spinner? Yeah, you just have a spinner and uh, two buttons. Mm. It'd be it'd be totally fine. Unfortunately, the 2600 like driving controller only has one button. I don't know how you could do that. Mm. Mm. You'd have to tape another button to it or something. Uh, so let's go hard. Let's do hard and one more. Yeah, nobody wins the Nacho Wars. <laughs> There's no winner. <laughs> the the, the co-op version really seems to shine. Yeah, I like the co-op version a lot. Sorry, what was that? Hard? <laughs> yes, please. Okay. Hard two-player. Okay, this is... I only have four short. to protect. It's going to be very short. I like how the points show up um, in between rounds. I'm, I'm guessing the arcade did that too. Oh, he's already moving our Doritos. I know. Real sports cornhole. Somebody making cornhole? <laughs> it's a Phaser Cats game. Phaser Cat games for the 5200 making oh, cornhole. Oh no! Shoot! No! Oh no! <laughs> Half of them are gone. Oh, they're all over the place now. <laughs> this guy's going around in circles. Actually, that's funny. Fifty-two hundred would be a perfect platform for cornhole because of the analog <gasps> controller. They got one. You'd be like throwing it like ah! that. Now you have to make it. That's that's the perfect controller for that game. Either that or the Vectrex, because it has an analog controller too. What systems had analog controllers besides 5200 and Vectrex? Does anybody else know? I can't think of any. Uh, wasn't there... Besides home computers. I think that um, some home computers had analog joysticks because they were just like inverted mice, pretty much. No. Oh, he hit me again. That's so <laughs> funny. He yeah. hit me just as I spawned. I mean, not modern ones. Modern ones have analog controllers, obviously. Oh. But um, pre PS1, I guess. Or whatever the first oh my God, he hit me. analog controller was it the N64 was the first modern analog controller I can't remember Coco Deluxe Apple II PC joystick yeah those are computers they don't count consoles 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 Oh my god! Ah, stressful. Oh, they all ran into us. That's, that's still fast. a win. That's, 
Ah! Oh no! Sometimes they don't die! Ah! No! There's one, one left! left. Uh. Oh, you got him. <laughs> Blockade of bullets. No! Oh. oh, saved it. Just in time. Don't land to me. Ah! <laughs> it's good when they take themselves out. Yeah. As long as the last one takes itself out. Oh, no! no! Oh, oh no! Oh my goodness. Uh, <laughs> so Woo. it's actually encouraging hacks of real sports curling when it was released, but nobody took me up on it. This is a great co-op game. Yeah, it is. It is it's really, really fun. fun because it's you really, fun. really are cooperative in it. <laughs> yes. I mean, you can run into each other, but yeah, really, really great conversion. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I mean, I haven't played the arcade game or or this one because <laughs> I don't have my Vectrex set up. Um, but fun game, mm -hmm. fun for two players, mm -hmm. and uh, it doesn't last for long the game either because it's they're quick, it's, they're quick games. It's challenging because they start getting fast really, really like it ramps up really. really it quickly. does, yeah. yeah. So, did anybody say anything about the lights? No, no, no one even we've noticed. Added some lights, yeah, we've added lights. The pretty blinky lights in the background. Yep. Hopefully, they stay up. <laughs> and we've got a remote control for them yes, to we change do. the color. What color would people like to see? Let's see here. So get get change. On Come to on. The next game. There we go. We can do purple. We can do any color. We can flash them. It's weird. Um, strobe. Warning. Strobe effects. <laughs> there is a strobe one. In theory. I'm not is sure there? Where it is? Yeah. This. Well, that's. I think that's what they call strobe. Where it's it not very fast. Flashes. Yeah. Yeah. Is, and that's brightness. Can turn up the brightness and down the brightness. I don't the think next, that does much. Not much, but it does turn it down a bit. Yeah. So try and crank it. F next game is Frogus. Is a 2019 work in progress, so it's not done yet, but it's uh, lapsed for a couple years by Breck Brixius. Not sure if that's a real name or not, but he's on the Atari Age forums as SIO2. First posted July 6, 2017. Mm -hmm. It's 48k game. He's also made Alpha Race Cyber. Frogus, shoot the UFO 2015, and sick pickles for 7800. Um, sick pickles? Sick pickles. It's a, it's a 7800 version of fast food, I believe. Okay. Where you're eating, you avoid the purple pickles, and you eat all the burgers and stuff. It's very okay. simple. Okay. Simple game. Things are just that flying at you. It, it is cute. Um, mm. So it pretty much Frogger ish. Mm. Oh, 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 quick. Can I get it? Yeah, just in time. <laughs> Frogus. I noticed. I so Pac-Man Plus says that that they noticed. They were just telling Rosemary. Oh yeah. Rosemary, uh, are they connected to Alexa? No, they are not. <laughs> they can't Alexa, be turned turn on. Alexa, turn off the lights. Yeah. <laughs> we don't have Alexa. No, no Alexa here. No, no. We just have Google listening in on us, not yeah. Amazon. <laughs> um. So this is frogger-ish. Uh, you'll probably recognize it as a clone of something. Rules are a bit different, though. You must collect a fly to enter the gate slash cave. Okay. Get killed, and you must get another fly. That okay. is pretty much fly. it. Okay. So, go for it. Need a clapper, someone said. Clapper. No, it's not working. Oh my goodness, okay. <laughs> Death right away. So you're an orange frog, so you have to collect a fly first. You were not oh, listening to the instructions. No, I heard you. I heard you. Oh, you I forgot. wasn't sure if they were random, but it looks like it just it, it cycles through the middle. So okay. it's not Frogger, it's Toter. <laughs> oh my gosh! Squish. Oh my um, so some updates they did it's added fast. a two-way traffic and time pressure. So the little uh, square black blocks in the middle at the top—that's how much time you have left to complete the level. Um, and you can get more flies. Oh. You only need one, but you do. You can get four, four flies. Our Alexa responded to you. Oh, that's funny. Ah. <laughs> Alexa, order the Atari VCS. <laughs> Alexa, order a Miko. Don't, don't watch it, you. <laughs> order a Miko. <laughs> There's no Miko on it on uh, the uh, on uh, Amazon. Oh, so. so did ours. Had to turn my lights back on. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> 
<laughs> Let's try this again. Okay. Here Alexa, order Coleco Chameleon. Yeah. <laughs> Ordering Amiga. Oh, Amiga. Oh, yeah, it is, it is similar. Yeah. Bad Alexa. <laughs> Yeah, that's the danger. Like, of anybody saying, um, like, the G word or the ah, A word oh or, um, what's the Apple one? Oh, the S word. Siri. Yeah. You sorry, can, you sorry, can, sorry, sorry. You can trigger everybody. You have to get a fly first. You can trigger other people's things in videos. It's crazy. Or movies It's crazy or that TV you can shows. do that. It just just doesn't seem quite right. Sorry, does it? Bob. <laughs> Seriously, please stop. I will. I won't say it anymore. <laughs> done. We're done. Anymore. We're done. That's very uh, very mean. Yeah, that is. Um, the time pressure meter at the lattice box is at the top of the screen between the score and the extra lives indicator. Yeah. And your frog is at the top right, showing how many froggies you have oh. left. And your score, top left. Oh! <laughs> Run! It's, panic it's, frog. You can't line up. It's lining it up is a little challenging sometimes. Yeah. Also change the way the extra lives indicator works so it shows lives remaining, not including the current. Not including the current? Yes. That's how it should be. It shouldn't be how many... <laughs> You have left plus the one you're playing should not be indicated. That's for sure. This version also displays a line near the bottom marking a safe zone where the frog starts and can retreat to. So you're safe down at the bottom if you ever want to go back and... Oh, some of them don't let you return. Does it ret let you return down at the bottom? I, I, yeah. If you I'm... hop out and back in, try it on a safe. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so you can be safe. Um, another update at the beginning of the game. The number 10 is displayed at the right of the rightmost cave. Oh, it's not anymore. Because it was how many flies you had to get for a free frog. But I guess you can't get any free fro frogs anymore. Uh, you may only have a maximum of five frogs in one play mm -hmm. and four in reserve. Uh, but if you collect 10 bonus flies but already have the minimum maximum frogs, you will not receive a bonus frog. Um, we haven't received or cheat, reached the point where AI is smart enough to ignore things. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Or to learn your specific voice too, because it really it should be trained to just you. Well, or your family members. They're supposedly. No, they're not. Obviously, I'm I, triggering I, I, everybody's. Yeah. Smart devices, not so smart. Yeah. Do, 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 do. <laughs> 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 Execute order 69. Yeah. <laughs> uh, and then the last update was Nostalgia 37 was kind enough to provide some new sprites with frog that displays more movement. A new fly and some smaller cars that folks are wanting. So I have put those sprites into what I was working on last. I was working on switching from a continuously random generated field of cars to a pre-generated field of cars when things got busy around here and the project got set aside. So there are a number of glitches and rough spots in the attached files. For example, the option to set difficulty, uh, dense tra dense traffic, light traffic, normal traffic is still in the menu, but will not affect the number of cars on the screen at this point. Mm. There's also an option in the menu to select the color of your frog. We you didn't see that. I'll do oh. that next time. Color of nice. the frog sprite and the color of the frogs in the caves does not always match and so on. Does recognize individual voices. I don't yeah. know if it can be set to ignore unknown voices. Yeah, I think that's more oh. the issue. Is so it'll respond to both in different situations. Well, they are faster. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. One interesting glitch is that the old way I was doing things, the program would not insert a fly near a car. Since it was constantly inserting and removing cars, oh, I just put a fly in between the cars. Yeah. With the constant field, I had to come up with a different way of making sure the fly didn't get placed on top of a car. That part I got, but it currently is nothing preventing it from putting a fly right back in the same place. You just picked one up. So you may get multiple flies at one time. Needs work, obviously. So you could just remember what line you put the last fly and say, don't put it in that line. I would think that would be an easy way to do it. It seems that the traffic doesn't really change. Like it's the same pattern of cars. Oh, that was tight. Very close. So today, Atari had an asthma attack. Oh, he's a little sick, kitty. And I tried to give him the emergency inhaler, because we have two inhalers. One for normal, just stuff he's supposed to get every day. And one when he's actively having an attack. 
And so I got the one where he's has actively having an attack and I tried to hold him down and um, give it to him. Uh, he did not like that one bit, and especially panicky because he's actively having an asthma attack oh, yeah. at the same time. So he good. flips out, accidentally bites me and scratches me oh. as he's struggling to get away um, because he's just panicking at that point. And uh, then he hated me for about an hour and a half. Oh. He was like, you betrayed me. You betrayed my little trust. Oh. He's, we don't know what to do. I think he's going to have to get medication. He's going to have to get pills. Yeah, yeah, I think so. So let's try yeah. and change. Oh my God, here it all is. Oh, frog color green, yellow, orange. Nice. Uh, It was on green, but the frog was not green. He was mm. orange. It turned green at the top at the end. Oh, okay. Yeah. Not used NA. Okay. <laughs> Traffic normal. So you played normal. Let's go for dense. That's not dense. I like Dan ABC's uh, comment. I can use my echo dot, but my sister can't because she can't pronounce that A word. So <laughs> <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's a good way to do funny. it. Too Just, bad you can't change the name. You and can. Then... You can. Oh. Yeah. You can. You can change the trigger On word. The A. Uh, you can for make. G. You can make it. Res I know with Google, you can make it respond to whatever you tell it to. So you can say the. Okay, whatever. Oh, um, you can you can Way make it respond long. to Bob if you wanted to. Oh, okay. So you can actually change the name. I, I know in Google you can at least do that. So, oops. Yeah, you could change it to whatever, oh, whatever really? you please. And I'm guessing different people could probably make it respond to different well, if trigger you... words if you wanted to. I suppose. Uh, maybe. Maybe. Because if you can change the name, then you won't accidentally get get it triggered by uh, people like me. <laughs> True. That's a good point. Yeah. It can be computer or Amazon alternatively. So I guess Alexa. Oh, computer. So there's only options. You can just pick option, those, two those options. options. But I know with Google, you can change it to whatever you want. As it should be. I would use computer like in Star Trek, yes. Computer. Okay. Com Earl Grey. Yeah. Hot. T. Earl Grey hot. T. Earl Grey hot. Yes. Yeah. I was reading the other day that the replicator can't replicate <laughs> living uh, organisms. So you can't, like, make a mouse. Yeah, I think that's true. Yeah, I don't think it ever did, did it? Uh, I don't think so. I'm not, like, the biggest Interesting. watcher. No, neither am I. I, I mean, I, I watched, mean, I watched Next the Next Gen. Generation a lot. Yeah, but... I did too, but... Um... And the original series, too. But... Yeah. Uh... <laughs> It's it's a good girl. Gee, I wanted to use computer because of Star Trek, but the rest of the household vetoed it. What? That's fun. They shouldn't have vetoed it. You can make it the Wilhelm scream. Oh my god! Yes. It's a hard one to do. That is. It's such a silly, silly scream. I think it has to be a word. Uh, well, I think you type in a word. I think you type in a word. Oh no, maybe you record it. I can't remember, but I would think you would just train it, right? Yeah. Oh, I gotta get in there. I don't know. I'm kidding. Yeah, I haven't oh, played with that. You could, you could make it anything, really. You could make it. Could you make it? I wonder if you could make it like a, a, a like a letter, um, not a letter code, like multiple words. Oh, like a phrase. Well, it doesn't. It doesn't know. You could make a like a long word. Right? I don't know if you can. I don't know. I I don't know. I haven't tested that out. It would be funny if you made it like you know. Planck's constant or something, you know, <laughs> like, like so you had to, you had to give a long series of numbers, pi, pi to, down to tenth six, digit. six, 16 digits, six <laughs> decimal places or something. Yeah. Maybe really hard. Yeah. I don't know. It'd be funny. Uh, it's, it's a, it's a fun Frogger game. Like it's I a good like twist. It. It's a good twist on yeah, Frogger. Yeah. Yeah. It needs to be it's Frogger, but everything's a little faster. Harder. Well, uh, yeah, you do reach a point and uh, uh, it doesn't seem to get harder. And the traffic doesn't change. So that does need, I think that needs to be mm -hmm. um, updated. But he hasn't worked on it in, in a three, little while? three years. So oh, okay. I don't know if they, don't bite me. Oh, why not, is he biting you? Because he's, that's his, I'm he's hungry. Mad? Oh, he's mad. No, he's, he's, he's hungry. He's not hungry. Well, he wants treats. No, whether he does or not want he's treats. That's very, that's very true. Good job. Thank you. Half Frogger, half Freeway. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Actually. 
And you're meant to stay in the traffic in this one, collecting the flies. It's not a rush for the end. Yeah, it doesn't seem to get any really appreciably faster. Like it's a little bit faster. But all the cars move at exactly the same speed relative to each other. So the openings are always there. Like I can always just go like this. Yeah, it's true. Yeah, you, you figure out the patterns between do, them. Do, 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 do. <laughs> like it's like you just yeah. once you figure it out. Points, it's, though, but still. <laughs> no, not for dodging cars. No. And the flies, if you don't get them, they, they stay in the same lane. They so do. you just wait for it to come by. Just go again. near the lane and then oh I ran out of time. It's playing is around too time? much. Yeah, it's the... Oh, there is. You don't listen to my instructions at no, all. No, what, what was the time you were referring to? It's the black block boxes in the middle. At the middle top. That's the time you have left. Oh, the countdown. okay. Yeah. No, because I was probably playing when Oops. you were talking. So. Yep. I know whenever I need flies, I go running out into traffic. Well, it's place. the best place to get flies, really. <laughs> yeah. Charles Whelan, bell not bite. Yes, bell <laughs> don't not get, bite. If you don't want to get bitten, put the bell back the, out. Well, the bell is <laughs> only uh, triggered yeah. by the chat. Like, we really don't give him much treats outside of no, the show anymore. No, we don't. <laughs> so he's really conditioned now. Treats, show equals treats. Show equals treats. treats. That's why he's here the whole time. Yeah. Like, I, if you look at older episodes, you'll notice he's not really around that. The cats weren't, weren't around that much <laughs> they during the show. They were and out. They would just kind of, they'd be there and they'd be like, I'm bored. And then they'd go, you know, sniff around the house. <laughs> now, now that now he's here the whole time. 100% restrained. attentive. The whole time. Yep. How ah. to get your cat's attention. Yeah. Food. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Lay down. Carl G pointed out uh, Thomas finished a game after, what, 20 years? So, you know, you never know. Very so true. I think it was 14 it. Uh, for uh, Robot oh. City. Ah. Oh. I think it was 14 years Ooh. from start. Mm. From the start? Oh, I died. Um, yeah, cool game. Uh, it needs a bit more. It needs a variety of traffic, like different lengths of cars, different speeds of cars. Like they all move exactly the same speed, all of them. Um, I don't know what else. Uh, if you don't get the fly, it moves. Like if you don't get it fast enough, it should move to another level because I can just sit there and then get it. Or if, get it, it, if get it, it jumps between the levels, like it just constantly Oh, it could shifts. fly. It could fly on top of the cars. No, it, w it could go through one row and then, then randomly appear in another row, then randomly appear. I don't know could. if that's easy or hard, but... Well, that'd make it very hard to it go would chase make it, it. Yeah, exactly. Maybe two passes. Um, maybe, maybe. But I, I think flying like a fly over the traffic, like this. Oh, that would be fun. Like independent of the traffic. Yeah. Like it doesn't go with the cars. Yeah. I think that would be, that would be really cool. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I like Alfred, Shoot the UFO, and Sick Pickles too. Sick all pickles. made by the same person. I don't think we played Shoot the UFO or Alpha Race. I think we played Sick Pickles. I'll have to look into that. Slowly Sick working my way through the back catalog of, of 7800. 7, yeah, I've yeah, done yeah. most uh, non... What is that game called on the 2600? Can't remember. Most decent games on the 2600 I've done the homebrew mm -hmm. for. Because doing this for four years mm -hmm. um and 7800 hey, making Kefferman my way through it. Hey, thank you for Man, thank you for 23 months nice. oh my goodness it's a long time okay we're moving on to the last game not quite yet because i have a video of the arcade because it is a port of an arcade game hey switch over come on listen to me <laughs> <laughs> it's being naughty. Yeah. Those lights are real? They are. They are real. They are real. See? Very pretty. Gone. And back. I've reset them. So now they're in flashy mode. Um so Super Circus Atari Age from 2017 by Bob Di Crescenzo. Uh first posted 2010, August 10th. Uh this build is from 2017, June 11th. It's a 32k game. So let's take a look at what it was like in the arcade. 
When is ZPH playing real sports cornhole? Kathy Man 2 d wants to know what's in cornhole. Oh my god. As soon as Phaser Cat Games oh, makes it good. and I fix my 5200. <laughs> is that how to cheat? Uh, no, it's real. <laughs> like the bouncing sound. Meow. Sorry, is this the arcade? This is the arcade version. Oh my gosh, it's so crazy. I love it. It, <laughs> it, looks, it looks like a, a parody of a game. It does. It's like, so funny. The movement is really... The way he bounces around up there? Not computer-like. It's so bouncy. Yeah. Next April Fool's Day. That would be good. Yeah. Oh, that's what I... See, the problem is if I pretended to have games that didn't exist on April Fool's Day... Oh, that would be funny. I wouldn't be telling people what I'm actually playing. Yeah. <laughs> but I want people to know what I'm actually playing. Mm. But, oh, I could... Everybody forget what I'm saying right now. Yeah. <laughs> Next year, I could, like, say I'm going to play a game. And yeah. it's like, oh, it's a new game. But I wouldn't be able to attribute it to anyone. Yeah. And then also have other games. But everybody would be so disappointed <laughs> that it didn't exist. They'd be mad. Everything yeah. I think up, just I would think, would make people mad. Well, what like Skyrim twenty six hundred? That would they that would that. that would well no, but it I has mean, to that's be believable funny. at the same time. Yeah, but I bet people would tune in just to see <laughs> if someone tried to create a Skyrim. I mean, you could you could make it. You just yeah. have to be overhead. View. Maybe you just wander around and uh, search search for Nernroot the whole time, <laughs> like. <laughs> <laughs> glowing Nurn Nur glowing Nurn root and by the by starts, the by the river bed. The, the screen starts glowing a little bit. <laughs> yes. You have to search every spot on the river. Uh, yes. It would be a quick show. Yeah. <laughs> this person's cheating, by the way. Oh yeah. See, no, because he's dying. He should be dead many, be many dead. times over. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Now that we've uh seen lots and lots. Oh, they actually t died right at the end. Eventually, they turn off the cheat. Yeah. So, um, so you can see the death. Um, okay. Oh, love you, Togo. Hola. Hola. Let's switch over. Oh, switch the car cartridge as well. RC70 said Rocket League did an amazing joke this year, a mode where the cars just had three wheels, one in the front. That's very Mr. Bean. Oh, yes. Uh, it, it'd be funny if people released stupid mods of homebrews. <laughs> yeah, you could come up I with I mean, some they would be legitimate mods. hacks, though. <laughs> that, well, no, but still, uh, yeah, I can oh, see that. Oh, right. This is a paddle game. Oh, for the so 7800. Very, very rare. Very rare. Here, hold these. Hold these. Atari 2600, dude, I had clowns on my C64. I don't oh, know what that uh, is. Clowns, I swear I had that as well. Uh, like this is a one or two player game too. Oh, cool. Yes. Yeah, very nice. Atari Age presents Super Circus Atari Age. Um, okay, so I think I have to go down first with the joystick and then set it to battles. Yeah. And now you can control it with the battles. There you go. So, classic Circus... Um, so, we'll do Classic Mode on first. Because... Oh, press button. Okay. Because that's the arcade version. Okay. Yep, I've got the paddles in the second port. At first I was like, what is... I can't... How do I set it to paddles if the paddles aren't plugged in? And Yeah. Um, refill. I would just leave everything normal right now. Okay. And I would go to start game. So you have to get that little guy. Oh my goodness! Okay. Get used to the get used to the sensitivity. Move him first before you press the button again. All good. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> so hard. Uh, Circus is a block breaker arcade game released by Exidy oh, in 19... You have to flip them. You have to flip, okay. In 1977. It's an old game. Uh, and distributed by Taito in Japan. The game is a rethemed variant of Atari's Breakout. Oh, you got some! Yay! 
oh. <laughs> where the player controls a seesaw and a clown in order to pop all the balloons in the level. The game has been copied and released under different names by numerous other companies in both the United States and Japan. Get up there. Oh, oh. you were lined up. I was trying to look at what, what he was getting. <laughs> There can never be enough paddle games. Paddle is such a unique... Oh, you thought he was going to hit the side there. Oh, so hard. <laughs> paddle is such a unique controller and is definitely not utilized enough. Um, I mean, it's very hard to make a paddle game on the 2600 because it uses up so many resources. Um, Bob, does it is it the same for a 7800 that it chews up resources as well? Like you have to keep checking it constantly, like on the 2600? Oh, uh, very jittery paddle. Is it? Or is it you? Oh, it's both. <laughs> <laughs> it's both. A little of column A and a little... Oh, you have to oh, switch over. I always... A little of column B. I played this before. I should do. I actually watched a video on how to clean paddles, and I was, like, very tempted, but I didn't have time to do it. They're not that bad. It's just very sensitive. This has a very rare adventure themed balloon that makes an appearance sometimes. Oh. On the on the other version of the game? Game over. Game over. This is a very quick game. <laughs> so on the Atari Age store, this is described as big doings under the big top. Super Circus Atari Age, how good are your reflexes? As the clown bounces around in different directions, you try to catch him on the teeter totter. Oh. Uh, or seesaw, depending on where you live. Uh, send them up to the top of the big top to pop red, yellow, and blue balloons worth different points. The harder the pop, the more you score. Oh, rating! Welcome, Kevin Buffalo viewers, to the show. We're playing new games, newish games, on old consoles. And today we're playing 7800 games. And this is... Super Circus Atari Age, originally put out in 1977, but this one is from um, 2017. I, I don't have info on when it was released on cartridge. But yeah, that's how you that's do it. That's a good one. New games. I was just playing Astroite on the Jaguar. Oh, my Jaguar is coming ah. soon. I'm very looking forward to my Jaguar. And... Um, you can, some homebrew. you can feel the pain of the clown as they disintegrate on the ground Splat. from the height. Horrible. Horrible. <laughs> uh, gameplay. Score as many points as possible by breaking up all of the balloons. Oh, you're so close. Get those last ones. Oh, no. well, you made a new row. That's good. Terrible. Uh, so you want to switch over to... Oh, we started again. Yeah. Do you want to... Do you want to die? I can yeah. die. Oh, I can... I, no, it. it's easy enough to die. Okay. <laughs> it's very easy. There you just we go. don't move. And the splatty splats. Uh, okay. Catching all the power up balloons and occasionally drop from a pop balloon. Oh, actually, I'll read this after. So go to classic mode off. Okay. And start game. Oh, different? It's Oh, my goodness. It is updated. Oh, squish. A little less squishy. I, I find that's less brutal than, than the little stick figure dying. I had to reserve the bottom <laughs> half of the screen just to read the paddles. Wow. That is a lot of time. Switch. Oh. So just like Breakout, you kind of want to get them up in the top bouncing around. Yeah, once you get them up there, you're like, oh yeah, that's how you play. Yeah, I do need to deoxid the paddle. It's not too bad, but uh, so there's some power-ups. Uh, let me read what those are. D is for drop. Drop the balloons one level, although this can get very difficult very quickly. S, slow. Uh, slows the speed of the balloons across the screen. Oh. No, I'm, listen I'm trying to listen to you, oh, so don't. yeah, it's, don't. it's hard. <laughs> uh, F for fast. You don't want F. Uh, what is N? N it's a net. Ah. It's a net. Oh, that wasn't uh, listed there. Uh, R reverse reverses the direction of the balloons. T top line gone clears the top line. M middle line gone clears the middle. B bottom line. P players awards a player with a bonus turn. Uh, I don't have the full list because that was a U. So this should be an extra life, and it was. Oh, 
Oh. This now is cool. Can... It's very breakout. Yes. And Arkanoid with the dropping part. So he's oh. added Arkanoid elements. Arkanoid, to that's what I'm thinking of. Yes. Sorry. Yeah, not breakout. I mean, it is breakout originally. This is so cute. Shades of Arkanoid and the power ups. Yes, definitely in Phaser Cat games. Okay, so let's read about this version. Score as many points as possible by breaking up all the balloons, catching all the power-up balloons that occasionally drop from a popped balloon, beating the boss balloon. Oh. Uh, and catching one of the bonus items that periodically float across the screen. Catch your clown on the high end of your teeter-totter, located at the bottom of the screen, so that the clown on the opposite end gets flung into the air. Catching your clown on the outermost edge of the teeter-totter causes him to fly higher. So if you catch in the middle, he doesn't fly high. You have to get on that very end to get him to go higher. Yeah, but then he bounces back really quickly, too. Yep. Need the laser gun. Yeah, no kidding. Pop, pop, pop. Yeah, the second player can pop the balloons with the laser gun. Uh, you have three rows of balloons at the top moving uh, on the screen, each a different color. And each moving at a different velocity. There are also two sets of bumpers that will bounce your clown in different directions when hit. You start the game with three re reserve clowns. Each time you miss, catching a clown with your teeter-totter, or land a clown on top of the other, you lose a reserve clown. If you lose all the reserve clowns, your game is over. Is there light highlighted pixels on the yellow balloons? Yes, there's very, very bright white shininess. And then a darker kind of green yellow for the know, stem. Is that what you call it? The stem of the balloon? Ooh, some power-ups. Oh. You only get the boss balloon when you have refill set to all. Oh. Okay. So we, we we'll don't have get to change boss that. Balloons, we want a boss balloon. Yeah, we want to see it. Maybe you can uh, see We'll change it. the settings when we go to two-player. Because you start, catch it's, on the it's edge. almost distracting the things falling down. So let's go to ref. Oh, I'll, I'll play by myself yeah, and play, then we'll do play. two player. So let's go to refill all. I think the concept of reserve clowns needs to be explored further. <laughs> <laughs> reserve clowns. Reserve clowns. That is quite the phrase. So I'm going to put on yeah. easy mode. Okay. So we can. Was it on easy? No, it was on normal. Oh, oh what's what? that? That's from Adventure. What is that? I wasn't. Oh, missed. Just getting the power ups. Oh, your your Never row is gone. Never get the power ups. You only have two two rows of balloons. Ah, so you have to pop all of them before they come back. Ugh, oh, missed it. Yeah. No, oh, the paddle's fine. Oh yeah, it's fine. These are. No, I never said. What? What? What are you saying? <laughs> what are you saying? People are saying it was jittery, it, but it, it's not. It, it's not. It's, it's not. actually quite good. It is quite. It's. It just takes a second to get used to it. Yeah. And you have to hit the boss balloon sixteen times. Oh my god! The chalice. Or the, oh, the chalice. Chalice. Or chalet. <laughs> chalice. 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 In French. <laughs> chalice. I don't know. <laughs> It does look like it's French, doesn't it? That boss balloon kills me. Ah. Oh, got rid of the oh, bottom row. Oh, you got rid of a row. Oh, that's what that did. I never really played Atari 2600 Circus. Oh, mm. I just never got it. I, I could never figure out... Oh. How to make the clown go higher. Oh, off the edge? Yeah, but now I know that you have to go to the edge of the, the seesaw. Well, that makes sense. So it always just like bounced and bounced and bounced and never made it up to the balloons. Maybe it's a bit more sensitive on the 2600 version? Maybe, on this version. This one's not too bad for getting it up higher. Yeah. So I, I always thought you had to bounce it a few times, too, sometimes. That's what I thought. Oh, what's going on? Nope. Oh, they're coming back! I thought I cleared the yellows. That's so too. Apparently, that is not true. How come he's just going straight up? I don't know. It's not bad, but okay. Yellows, come on! Yeah, he's not bouncing <laughs> at all. There we go. Ah, oh, so close. Oh, oh no, my no. last life. Okay, we're gonna play two players. Okay. Let's do. ZPH players. owns the last non-jittery pattern controller. It's not bad. <laughs> 
So we're going to go two players. You two triggered an adventure Easter egg. Oh. Immediately? Yeah, like, I don't know how you did that, but that's cool. <laughs> wow. Okay, two? we're going to do easy and okay. two simultaneous. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is very... Oh my god, there's two of them? <gasps> oh my god. Oh, that's hard. So either person can get either one? No, I don't think so. Oh, okay, no, you don't. So I just get the blue guy. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, it's so hard to see with the other person there. Oh, it's game over. What? Oh, you have to press the button to trigger your guy. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'm not sure about this two-player mode. <laughs> it's very hard to see. Okay, let's try it again. Okay. So I can let you go. Yes, until I die. But that's not simultaneous, really. It is simultaneous. Ugh. Can okay. you catch that? Mm. You're doing yours at the same time? Why? Because you're trying to... You want us to die? Is this no, what you're trying help. to do? Stop moving it so fast across the screen. It's so hard I'm to see. I'm just going to stay here because it's really hard. Can you catch those? No, I don't think so. Can you try? I want, oh, see? So distracting. I know. I know. Oh, what my goodness. What about me? Well, you didn't press the button. Well, I'm not pressing the button until there's... <laughs> You want uh -oh. it that way? We need a marriage counselor. <laughs> Super Circus are Super Circus Atari age. It's triggered problems. Anger issues on anger, anger issues. issues. Oh, oh, one more. Ah! Oh, get it. Get it. Oh. It's no. very distracting. Very distracting. Oh, come on! Get it! Get it! No, stop going the same direction. Okay, get it then. <gasps> Yay! Oh, oh, it's a big Atari age! Oh, stop. Oh my god. Oh, how do you stop it from doing that? It just keeps going over there. Like, there's no option. Like, it... Maybe if I do that? Oh, okay. Because it depends on which side. It jumps on. Yeah. Oh my Ooh, god. That was... It's bad because it hits and then it comes oh, down immediately. Oh no. Oh, you got one more. Hit that balloon. Oh no. Oh, oh, did we start? You've got another another life. You had another oh. life. You must have gotten one back or oh, something. Why did the oh, why? boss go away? Does the boss go away when you die? Uh, it's yeah. like a bonus, I yeah, guess. Yeah, it's a bonus oh, boss. Okay. Oh, damn. Are you chewing? What's no. wrong with you? <laughs> you just... Huh? Okay. What's wrong with uh, Want to do sim simultaneous again? Sure. Okay. I'll go first. <laughs> when you don't die, if... don't immediately hit the button again. <laughs> okay. I don't know if this is the point of... Simultaneous? I don't know, but it... Can you catch those? Can you no. try? No, no you're not going to try. No. But we're both no, playing. No, you've, you've... They're not designated. No, to it, one person no, or the other. No, it doesn't work. It doesn't work. Okay, you play and I'm going to catch those because you're not even trying to catch them. You're like, no, they don't work. They don't work. <laughs> you didn't even try. How does it even know? See, and now you're distracting me and I didn't catch it. That's your fault. So you go. You go. <laughs> uh, dead. Spam. Uh, no. You're dead? How dare you? Spam my channel. Uh, we were playing the ar the arcade version. They're both in this in this game. Oh oh oh! Oh no, he uh, moved. I was like, maybe it'll just keep going. <laughs> stick figures when I left. Fancy sprites when I came back. Yeah, <laughs> yeah there's two different versions, like the yeah. original, and then this is like the souped up version. Oh. Where's the rest of them? It takes so long to come back. Oh god. Oh no, I have another one. It's okay. Oh no! <laughs> that Both me. game over. Oh, we need to get to the boss. We did get to the boss. Ugh. Briefly. Briefly got to the boss. Right. Oh, come on. Maybe we can't get it. I don't know. But 
How does it know who's gonna get it? What? What do you mean? The things that are falling down, if we both no, have a guy in, in so. play... I don't... Well, it, you it's only the ones that you free you get, I think. Oh my goodness, that's gonna be hard you to think? keep track of if everybody's playing at once. You can't get it when you're dead. Oh. Only when you are in play can you catch the falling balloons. And either player can pick them up as long as they're actively playing. Gotcha, okay. So because... You both you... have to be actively playing them. Right, so... so... Is what's gonna happen? You really have to, like, concentrate on your guy. Oh! oh. <laughs> Brutal. Both died. Ugh. I thought I just had him. Oh my god. Uh, uh, I don't know if that's hard. better. <laughs> Let's try it again together. Oh, your turn still. Some clowns were harmed making this game. Yeah, no Oh kidding. yeah, many clowns. Many clowns perished in the disaster. <laughs> TD. Now I want to buy AA balloons. <laughs> oh, yes, you should give those. Oh, you started? Okay. In the in the uh, shipments, you should you should get some AA balloons printed. Mm hmm That would be pretty funny. Oh god damn it. Urgh. I don't know what that was. I hope it was another life. Hope so. Give it. Oh. oh. I got it because I just restarted. Oh. That is so funny. That is. Oh, good. We have a net. No. And it's and gone. And it's gone. <laughs> Was that you? Yeah. Oh, immediately gone. Oh, oh. game over. I'm like Damn two it. away. I was hoping to get to the big, the big guy. Two away. And get it, get it, get it, get it. And, oh. I'll just bounce like this. Everybody's happy. Everybody's happy. Nancy Day. One day you're on top, the next day you're a clown. ID that quote. Oh, damn it. <laughs> Charles Whelan, we have a net and it's gone. And it's gone. <laughs> We're doing better. We're getting better. <laughs> oh, come on. It slammed. Oh, no. Same thing happened. It slammed against the ceiling and yeah. went straight down. Oh, boy. That was a lot of. Good bonuses. Which is not too bad now, keeping track. I've gotten used oh, to it. Oh, I'm still struggling. Oh, god damn it. We only have a couple more to go. Oh! You have one life, I have zero. Get those balloons, get no, them. No, it's not gonna happen! Oh, no, no, you jinxed me! <laughs> Yeah, they were telling bad, bad puns and jokes before the... What's going on? Oh, Press the button. Oh, you have one left! I got... I did get some extra lives in there, so... They are telling... Oh, uh, no! Oh, no. We gotta do it. We gotta make it. <sighs> an extra life. Yay! Oh, and gone. Oh, that's fast. Oh, God, I don't think I want fast. F no. Oh god, I'm terrible. Oh, it's I very it hard off. to mentally. It's over. Oh, no, no, you've got more. It's very hard to mentally keep track of them when they're bouncing around. Especially Need four-player co-op. <laughs> chaos. Absolute chaos. chaos. <laughs> well, it's paddles. You could. Ah. Oh. Mm. Need to defeat that boss. Okay, so cat games. They're not extra lives. They're reserve clowns. <laughs> 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 they are. <laughs> They're reserved clowns. Uh, oh, the poor clowns. <laughs> poor clowns. No respect at all. No. They're just, you know, completely oh. replaceable. Well, there seems to be an endless number of them, so. <laughs> there does. Poor clowns. Don't wreck our net. Oh, I think I did that. Oh. oh. 
messed ah. me up. Messed me up. <sighs> okay. I think I should have made this two player simultaneous have each player on a different vertical level. No. Mm, maybe. I don't know if I that would. No, I like help. it the way it is. It is challenging, but it's, it is. it's, it's pretty fun. It, it's very confusing, though. I don't know how you could solve it. Um, not sure different levels would help. Oh, at least, you so would be fast. able to see yourself, at least, I guess, mm -hmm. if it was on different levels, yeah. I guess you could, yeah, have it on different levels. Oh, that was. Oh, God damn it! I'm just not good at the game. That's that's one well, problem. Well, that's me oh. too. Oh. <laughs> the higher player would have to react faster. They would. There would be a oh, definite gosh. problem. It would be mad no matter how you did two players simultaneous. Yeah. I mean, we're getting better, but... Oh, definitely. Definitely better than when I first hard. started. This must have been like a quarter-eating game oh, in the God. arcade. Yeah. Like, just... Um, because it seems like you should be able to do it quite simply, but... I don't know. Is anybody good at this game? I'm sure there are <laughs> amazing players at this game. Are we just useless? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, who did that? Me! Ugh. Oh. It's very confusing. <laughs> oh, God. It's, it is so hard when, especially when there's a second person, it's like very distracting. Because uh, you can't to quite keep track see of your movement, yeah. And to see where you are in relation. Get out, get out of my way. Stop moving! Don't do that! Oh, come on. Almost there. We, d we did get to the big balloon, we just Yeah, didn't... I didn't pop it. I got a couple hits in, but... Yeah. It's funny that it all of a sudden just goes up, and I can't get it at an angle. Oh, when you hit the balloon, it goes at an angle. Oh, I can't butt. I can't butt. I'm too lazy to attempt a paddle game. <laughs> You're already better than I ever was at the 2600. I'm already better than I ever was at the 2600. I was terrible. I would just die instantly. Oh, you're confusing me so much. Ah, uh, you're, uh, confusing, you're me. confusing me. I'm confusing myself. Uh, I don't know where I am. Stop moving so quick. I'm, I'm trying to get back. You're like all over the screen and I'm like, oh my God, my eyes. I'm trying. Yeah, I can't. I can't. <laughs> it's so hard with two people. Okay, go, back go to the forth. far right or left. Yeah. yeah. I can't. Are you gonna play? Oh. Do you know how to turn a paddle? <laughs> he knows how to get treats. Yeah. How do you get treats? <laughs> do you ring a bell? Uh, do you ring okay. a bell? Looks like I got an extra life at some point. Yes. Oh. oh. Speaking RC of. RC70. Oh, did you hear that? Oh, two more left. One more left. I'm at the boss. Are you? Yep. Hopefully the timing time's up. No! Oh, no! No! I'm at the boss. Gonna ring the bell? You gonna ring the bell? Atari! Ring the bell! Good kitty! Good kitty. What? Went right through. Oh, I got an extra life. Yeah, you don't defeat the boss. You can't die on the boss level. Mm. Or it's over. It's like a bonus level. Smack it hard. Smack it hard. Can we do it? Smack it. Oh, damn it. Good kitty! <laughs> Oh, it's an AA balloon. That's what people are talking about. Yep. Yay! <laughs> AA! Oh, and there's an AA balloon that yep. people can put in there. Okay, so let's play two-player classic mode. Well, uh, maybe do a single-player round. I'm yeah. feeding the very big cat over there, so... Refill Thank you, RC70. Difficulty... Ooh. Hard? What is hard? It's faster? He rebounds faster off the... I don't know what hard is. It's faster. He's moving is faster, I think so, yeah. A little bit faster, yeah. maybe. 
Not like, like super fast, like between hard and easy. Good kitty. I mean, it's the same exact game. <laughs> Just different graphics. Oh, come on. Exactly, it's a bonus level, yeah. Fun bonus level, it's really, really cool. Oh yeah, get them all, get them all, get them all, look at that! Look yeah, at that, that was first good. hit! Oh, well, when we play Circus on the Atari 2600 for our marathon, now we know, we'll know how to play. Mm-hmm. Rather than just bumbling around and dying instantly. I do like it has the bouncy barriers on the sides. Yes. Because it does does mean that There's you have a little bit of respite, I guess, from yeah. immediate death if they hit the corner, so... Oof. Oof. Wow. Almost cleared a level on this... Uh... Oh, 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 almost there. So this isn't the rose coming back, though, because when I no. played it, the rose reappeared once you... Once this... you... Very good. This one is... Extra bonus. Oh, look at that! Oh, look, look at him go! go. Look, look at, at him it go! All. That's what happened the first hit it's on my last... It's so nice when that happens. Kins, I still have a treat in my hand. <laughs> he he obviously got it. It's under something now. Oh, it's like no. under our lights. Look at... Ring the bell. Ring the bell. Ring the bell. You gonna ring the bell? Ring the bell. Oh, no. This just seems easier. How can this be easier? <laughs> Good kitty! That's the last one there. <laughs> he tries to grab it. He doesn't like it when oh, I take the bell away. Damn it. Oh no! Doing way better in the Stickman version. <laughs> the original it, uh, Stickman it, version. It is... Oh, oh now I've said it. Spoke too soon. Now I've said it. Spoke too soon. Get it? Oh. Get up there. Oh, come on. That, yeah. Yay! Finally, popped one. Yay. Oh! So two left. Oh, come on. Oh, no. Oh. So close. Might be easier in hard mode because you have less time to yeah, think. Yeah, it's very true. That's very strange. Yeah. So, okay, let's play two player in hard. Mm -hmm. Oops. In classic mode? Yeah, classic, simultaneous, okay. hard. Ugh. still distracting. <laughs> it is. It's very distracting. Oh, come on. Oh, I can't see. Oh my god. In the way. Oh, same. <laughs> Not doing so well this time. I almost got them all too. Yeah. The seesaw is a bit more forgiving in this version. Like, I've just barely nice. got him on the end of it. I'm like, I should have missed. Oh. Oh, that did Got one more. There you go. I assume the plank person is on a hoverboard. <laughs> <laughs> yes. It's on rails. Yeah, how are they moving this big seesaw across the room? Yeah. Well, that's what the reserve clowns are doing. Well, they're, <laughs> they're waiting. pushing and pulling <laughs> yeah, yeah, it yeah. across. That's true. Yeah. He's he's just standing there waiting for his turn. <laughs> yeah. Let's do one more new version. Okay. New and hard. Okay, this is gonna be challenging. Oh, 
so I hard can't to see. see. I know. <laughs> It's so hard when they come down too oh. fast. Stupid. Oh, okay. Oh god. I had to switch. I, I couldn't tell which way I, I was. No. I find the classic mode a little easier. <laughs> it is. For some yeah. reason it is. I uh, think because it's they're they're really clear. I'm gonna play just by myself. Okay. Or alternating if you want. No, no, no. no. Okay. Uh, alternating, yeah, I don't think. Just and difficulty and, and. Hard? Yeah. Yeah. Classic mode? Yeah. Yeah, yeah not classic. Or sorry, the. New. New mode. Yeah. It seems weird that you want. You put classic off, but. Letting your wife catch the clown is a romantic gesture. <laughs> catch the clown, honey. <laughs> or, as as Kathy Mantudi said, jester. <laughs> jester. Funny. Very funny. Was that intentional, Kathy Man? <laughs> oh. It's going for the funny. bonus, which was an extra Pac life, Plus, and I didn't get it. James flipped both difficulty switches to A, so you have the barriers, and the opposite player can control them. Control what? the barriers? Oh. So I can I can bounce? Well, that sounds like fun. So Like the barriers on the side? Yeah, apparently I can control the barriers. Oh, okay. Well, oh. I'm about to die, so yeah. I'll be doing that. Sounds cool. Maybe. Okay. Stick to our cat. Go to A. Oh, there they are. That's annoying. <laughs> What am I doing? Don't know. I'm not Apparently you can the barriers. Control. Do you have to have it on two players, maybe? A oh, maybe. Hmm. Button doesn't do anything? No. Nothing? No. Okay. Let's try being on two players with barriers. Yeah. Simultaneous? No. No. What? Just one player. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's with the joystick? Is it with the joystick? Maybe. Is this the joystick? Yes, it needs to be two players. Oh, um. What? Um, alternating? Oh, it must be alternating. Because oh. you're actually playing. Yeah. Oh, there they are. Yep. Oh, my God. Oh, that's funny. Can so she I help? Can, I can oh, help. I can help. Oh, oh that's or great. Or I can hinder. Don't hinder. Thank oh, you. and now it's my turn. I see. Oops. It's okay. If you hinder, you hinder. <laughs> oh, my I'm God. I'm neither trying to help or hinder, actually. <laughs> <laughs> trying to keep him up there. Help. There you go. Oh, this is good. This is a good two If player. you're trying to help. Yeah. <laughs> two player alternating. Two, two player, player hinder, hinder mode. mode. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's pretty funny. Oops. You are, you are hindering more than you have. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying. Wow. I'll do it again. That's fun. That is. Oh, sorry. Oh my goodness. It's harder. It's harder than you think. It is. Oh. Because <laughs> there's more barriers now. It's so slippery, too. It's very slippery. Distracted me. <laughs> Sorry. Oh my god. I was trying god. to get under it to kind of get it to bounce. So fast! Oh, 
Ah, so hard. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I mean, he. I think it was be a month in between when he first posted it, and oh, then yeah. when he finished it. I, or was that the first game? Mm. Uh, let me see. Oh, I don't. I don't have that information. Unfortunately. Let's try this again. This is very interesting. So it's it's kind of like you're playing Breakout at the top, and I'm playing mm. Super Circus at the bottom. <laughs> <laughs> you're like playing a mini Breakout. Oh, sadness. Don't don't spin it like that. Oh, you didn't help me enough. I did. I, t I helped as much best as I could. Get out of there. Get. Come on. Ugh. Kittens. Kittens. Psst, psst. Get. Thank you. It's very hard. It's mostly hindering. <laughs> it is. Yeah, see, three, two, two times hindered. Oh, it went right through it. Looked like it went right through it. Just off the edge. Oh my god. Up, stay up, up. Oh. Oh, and then I'm looking at you. <laughs> oh. One more. We've got to master this. RC70 Mo Hunter. <laughs> sorry. Oh. <laughs> sorry. I wasn't even paying attention to what was going on there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, extra life came down. Oh, Can't no. Is that what that dead. was? Yeah, P for player. comes down so fast. We are in hard. We should put on easy. I don't know what we're doing. Oh, this cat's distracting me. I blame you. <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh god, I can't even okay. catch it anymore. Let's put on easy. Okay. But See if that helps. Did not ask for cat butt. Okay, now it's on easy. Whatever difference that makes. I don't think, um... Or maybe it's easier because... It's easier to catch... The clown on the end of your... <gasps> no, Or it goes not. higher? Maybe it goes high. <laughs> no, it doesn't seem to be going higher. What is the difference between easy and hard? Oh my god. Pac-Man Plus. So I really can't <laughs> find any difference whatsoever. Maybe because we're so terrible. We're being terrible right now. <laughs> it's so distracting. It is. It is so distracting. It's. Okay. It, I definitely think it's easier when you play, like, on your own. Yeah. Kid. Right, switch it back. Um... Okay, one more alternating, no things at the top. Alternating? Yeah. yeah. Boo. <laughs> no, it is pokey. I had to um, figure out the, which one is going to work on my system, and I picked wrong. It was the 4,000, not the 450. I'm getting worse now. Yeah, I think so. Okay. I was getting better, and now I'm getting worse. Oh, my God. Easy That's doesn't get fast. as fast as normal, and hard gets faster than normal. Okay. So the top speed of the, the clowns. Okay. Still very fast. <laughs> oh, top row. Taken out. Oh, oh too fast enough. Mesmerized the by the popping yeah, balloons. Just, you don't want to move too much. And then... Oh, that's true. Just catching that clown. Oh, slow. Nice. It's just the balloons that go slow, right? Yeah. Or... yeah, not your clown. Oh my god. No, he needs to slow down, though. Takes a turn. <laughs> Obviously not TIA music when you listen closely. It's all in tune, three channels. Okay. 
Very fun game. I so love, much fun. I love all the different modes on it. I love the two-player mode, actually. Yeah, it's... Playing together, so chaotic. <laughs> it's so chaotic. It's so much fun. Very chaotic. I do like chaos. I think that's the best part of multiplayer games, when Is you're all, the on the, all playing something on the screen at once. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, so... We have a lot of amazing stuff coming up soon. Let's take a look at that right mm, now. Mm -hmm. Just filled in and changed a bunch of things. Um, we did an After Dark last night. Um, that should be posted in about an hour or so. Mm -hmm. Did a late After Dark. Very late After Dark, yeah. <laughs> and uh, got very, some very good scores on Tober's Nightmare and um, Turbo. Decent, yeah, Decent yeah. Scores. Decent scores. I was very scores. happy with them. Yeah, it was fun. Um, so next... So uh, late, RC7. It was so. very late. <laughs> um, so la next episode, we're going to be having two exclusive world premieres. One, Razor's Edge um, by Leonardo Santiago, mm. who did... Uh, Cajo, chases, Cajo the chases, chases the Cheese and also... Unholy. Unholy. I was mm -hmm. trying to remember that. Thank you. And we also have Uzi the Goo Maze... Uh, Uzi the Goo, Maze Quest by VHZC. Nice! So we have two big exclusive world premieres Always on exciting. Friday. So yeah. good stuff. And uh, then we're going to be playing a bunch of 8-bit games. And then the next Friday after that is the exclusive world premiere of Dark Keep. Very cool. Um, it is by EA Smith mm -hmm. and Kevin Moss 3, um, the extraordinary team. Um, that one for uh, that Kung Fu Combat 2 oh, for the graphics. Oh, the graphics, yeah. The graphics in Dark Keep destroy those graphics. What? And they won for best Not graphics. Possible. It's Not possible. unbelievable. Full screen, play field, animated dragon graphic. That's amazing. So this is adapted from a board game. So we have Darcy there. Next oh, Friday, he, he owns... He is the bar, board game expert, so... He owns a board game store, yes. so he's definitely the expert. Yes. So he's going to talk about all things board games. Excellent. And how this conversion, you know, uh, yeah, it does look great. They've yeah. been posting some screenshots, so I'm really looking forward to that. Nice, nice, nice. Um... Then I've scheduled an After Dark, now that we've kind of caught up. Uh, May 6th, After Dark. That's like the second to last day for yep. getting scores in for oh, the 2600 good. High Score Showdown. Nice. Um, Lots of other stuff in the planning, too. Yeah. Atari yeah. Age Day 2022. I've almost got in contact with all the developers with new releases coming mm -hmm. out. Um, Champ Game Secret Homebrew. It's coming next month. That's a big one. Live interview with Old Style, who we will have the final version of Mario Brothers, plus have an exclusive world premiere of his new game. You definitely don't want to miss that. Plus, maybe we'll find out what the next game after that is. You don't even know the next one, but the next one after that is going to blow your mind. <laughs> Blows my mind. Um, Developer Spotlight with Todd Fermansky, who did all the Dragon games, plus nice. his new game, Harpy's Curse, exclusive world premiere of that. Uh, don't know when. He's still working on that. So that might be a month or two. Don't know. Um, uh, and the 45th birthday marathon. Yay. Playing through August and September, leading nice. up to its birthday on September 11th. Nice. Um, don't know how long that's going to take. Many weeks of After Darks. <laughs> Many weeks of After Darks. Playing through every single game ever released mm -hmm. for the Atari PAL, NTSC, um, all the original ones, not the variants and stuff, but mm -hmm. actual original games. Devs are on fire. The homebrew home scene is amazing across all platforms. Yes. I 100% agree. Off topic, but I saw a different Twitch channel playing Atari 2600 homebrew. How dare they? <laughs> I, have a, I have a patent on that. No. Uh, there's a few. That's cool, though. There's a few that play them once in a while. Yeah, that's yeah. nice. That's nice. Yeah, because they deserve lots of attention. wonderful attention. Yes, they do. Um, yeah, special game <laughs> night game. Yeah, yeah, we're going to dedicate the whole episode to Dark Keep. Oh, really? Because it's a board game. It's going to take a while. Oh, to play you and Darcy are going to and, love that. And yeah. dive into it. Yeah, nice, it's going nice, to be nice, nice. A lot of fun. Someone said, "Is this the old Dark Tower board board?" It game? is. It's adapted ah, from the board game. Nice. I've never played it, so I'm going to have to watch some videos on how the board games was played. 
so I know how well it adapted over. Phaser but, Cat Games. I play my own games on my channel while developing them, and you can't stop me. <laughs> once I get my 5200, you're going to have to stop. And once I get it fixed, <laughs> you're going to have to shut that right down. Yeah. No. Once... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Once I get my 52 up, 100 up and running, then I yeah. can actually play your games Yay. on the show finally. Yeah. I'll have to do a big catch up day of 52 on Phaser games. Cat games. Oh, yeah. yes. Yeah. 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 That would be fun. Yeah. Counterfeit ZPH. Yeah. <laughs> um, what else was I going to say? I don't know. That's about it. Um, so, yeah, fun day today. Ripoff was fun. Frogus was fun. Super mm -hmm. Circus Atari Age was very fun. All, all um, great games, all yep. of them, all of them. Yeah, so, it's good so to catch up on yeah, some yeah. of these seven eight hundred that we have not played yet. Yes, you do need to do real sports cornhole. <laughs> you have to. Now that the Amico is maybe not coming out, how are we going to get our cornhole fix? Yeah. <laughs> We're going to have to have it on the fifty two hundred. The other channel has a cat. Uh oh. No, are you talking no, about does, a cat game? Says, but does the does. other channel have a cat? Not this cat. You know what? They don't have an Atari cat. Yeah. And really, the only place you can get Atari cat is this channel. Yes. So. It's the authentic Atari the cat authentic channel. The authentic bell ringing, <laughs> treat loving. And that's why you're all here, right? Yeah. Oh, thank Yay. you for following Retro Game Bygones, Adam. Yay. Wow, that's a long thank name. You. <laughs> yeah, glad you're enjoying it. Yeah. Uh, yes, it's Kung Fu Combat 2. That's what I was going to say. EA Smith is the perfect person to adapt a board game mm. because he, if you've ever played any of his games, his games have so many rules. Like, they're super complicated. Mm -hmm. It only makes sense that he is adapting a board game because that's that's his bread and butter is making these games with super complicated because he's he normally adapts sports games and he goes for, like, in-depth, complicated like 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 rules rules type, for it type yeah games. it's like oh yeah. you can do this or this or this so many options so it's yeah. so good yeah this channel pale, paled in comparison with that page that, it's fine yeah um no we're ha i think everyone's happy when uh, everybody wins everyone wins when yeah. more people show off people's homebrew games yeah as far yeah. as i'm concerned more exposure so. yeah. you know if one person sees the other yeah. show and goes and plays a, a homebrew because they saw it on there. That's I awesome. I think that's awesome, yeah. Yeah, the fluffy Atari. Yeah, he is he a fluffy. He is very fluffy. He's shedding all <laughs> over my black pants as Indirect speak. indexed homebrew. <laughs> is that what they're called? I-I-H? That's funny. That's so funny. Mm -hmm. That's a good joke. Okay. <laughs> uh, so thanks for hanging out with us. You definitely do not want to miss this Friday show mm -hmm. with Razor's Edge and... Uzi the Kume's Quest, crazy name. Yeah. Um, nothing is known about either of these games. There's no I'm screenshots. Always... There's no information. Um, yeah, and they're both very good. I like I have when played both of them. VHZC starts a new round of game development because <laughs> oh he he then adapts every it month. for every platform, right? Uh -huh. So this the Uzi the Kume's Quest, I'm very intrigued. For. It's interesting. Let's see what it's about. Yeah. It's definitely VHZC. Is it excellent? You, you excellent. can like you take one look at the first opening screen. You're like, that's VHZC. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He's, he has such a distinct style to his games mm -hmm. and you'll see it in this. It's a very different game though than any other game he's ever made. Okay, cool. But it's still distinctly him. Yeah. Uh, thank you very much, Atari 2600, dude. I had a lot of fun, too. Hope every, everybody did, too. Yeah. Uh, and thank you for watching. And RC70, Dan AVC, S. Ramirez. Oh, everybody go and play Dan AVC's um, Homebrew Harmony Games, 2022 Harmony Games. Uh, right now, it's Tober's Nightmare and Tober Arcade. Yes. Try, try and beat my score. Yep. I'm number one right now. Yep. So there's no. a challenge. Yeah, got to get more scores on that board. So yeah. yeah. So let me paste the link here. Um, oh, there you go. So you can click there. Um, uh, S. Ramirez, Kafman Tutti, Vitoko, Charles Whelan, Phaser Cat Games, Carl G. Pac-Man Plus. Thank you for hanging out mm -hmm. and making those awesome games. Amazing, we still have amazing more pac-man plus games to play oh yeah <laughs> and catch up on i i like a quite a few in his list still um who else charles whelan i think i said let's see going up the list here um spammers <laughs> uh 
Skip Natty. Oh, I didn't oh, answer the question. I didn't even see that in there. Uh, oh, to answer your question, if you're still watching, they asked, have you all played Ricky and Vicky? We have. We have, yes. We need to play it again. Yes. To finish the game because you cannot save while you're playing. Mm. You can continue indefinitely, but you nice. can't save. So we need to set aside like oh, many a hours. Nice chunk of time for yeah. that one. Yeah. Uh, Kevin Buffalo jumped in, I think, oh, from the... said hi. Yeah. Oh, from the raid. I think from the raid, yeah. Uh, oh, Rena Foot, way back. Yeah, Trey Guy. Trey Guy, a lot of chatters today. Oh, yes. that's the top of yeah. the buffer. Yeah, 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 yeah. Anybody else said their names? Nope. Oh, Baby Pac-Man. We, hmm. Did we play... I don't think we properly played Baby Pac-Man. That's the one or that's... did that's, we? That's the... Um, the paddles, the pinball... The, the pinball slash, slash arcade game. I, I we might have. It? Yes, we did. We did. Let me let me see. Because I can do a quick search. We're positive here. we did. Because I have every game I've ever played on the show right here. Baby. No, we have not. Really? We've only played it in his spotlight, which isn't a playthrough. It's oh, just... so we haven't actually done a playthrough of it. Oh, well, no. we're going to have to do that. Played lots of Pac-Man. Space Pac-Man, Junior Pac-Man, Snow Day, Pac-Man Arcade Enhanced, mm. Space Pac-Man, Super Pac-Man, that is his. Nice. Junior Pac-Man. You interviewed Bob, right? Yes. And I play, got yes. to play all so the games. So you played So that's it. why I remember I have the memory of playing it because that's I definitely right. did play it. So yeah, we haven't yeah. played uh, Baby Pac-Man nice. properly yet. Just, just okay. playing we'll through it while, while we're Absolutely. talking. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so, yep, that's it. Thanks for hanging out yes. with us. So have a good week and uh, definitely tune in on Friday for some more awesome brand new two world premieres for the 2600. Very exciting. So we'll see you on Friday. Yeah. Bye, everyone. Bye, have a good night. Have a good night.